Hey guys, Cam Photo Picks, and in this video I'm going to show you how you can turn a blurry, out of focus NAF picture into something that you may want to hang up on your wall. Now, I'll just show you the image we're going to use. Now, I took this image while I was in the car. Uh, I was the passenger, rolled down the window and snapped off this shot. Now, there's two reasons why I do this. One, I like to take photographs of just locations. Uh, for location scouting, whether or not it would be a nice wee place where I could have a, a shoot or maybe a, a place where I'd like to return for more, for more investigation to find out what the area is like. Usually though you just delete it off the back of your camera but I kept this one on basically for to try this technique out that we're going to do just now. So as you can see it's naff, it's, uh, I mean, it's out of focus, it's blurry uh, there is absolutely nothing happening in the image. Dead tree here and there's really nothing there. Before we start we shall duplicate the layer of the image. So right click and duplicate layer. And that's us now working on the background copy. And we'll just check the levels and as you can see the histogram is way out. So we'll just bring it up a tiny bit. And yeah I'd probably see about there. So what to do is, if you click on the levels adjustment that you've just done, right click and merge down, and it'll merge it down to the background copy. What I also want to do is, if you go to image, adjustment, and then what I want is shadows and highlights. And I'm just going to change the shadow detail a tiny bit, just to try and give a wee bit more colour and detail to the image. Now this is all going to change and I'll show you why in a second. So that's the before, this is it now after. So now what we're going to do is go up to filter and we're going to go to blur and then motion blur. Usually when you start off you'll have it something like this. What you want to do though is when you're got tree pictures of the trees you want to run in the, the vertical uh, lines of the trees so you want it to sit at 90 so you can either do 90 there or type 90 into the box and then this is just personal preference uh, what you can do is just keep up in the distance of the pixels until you get a kind of an abstract picture now this is just to your personal taste now I'd probably maybe go for something like that just to show that's what you're looking for also what you can do is colour balance and what we can do is just up that slightly to about there and then merge down and now what you've got is something from this image here eh, which you'd normally just bin to something like this that you could really get printed off and stick it on your wall as a wee piece of art so hope that's been of some use uh, what I'm going to do is I'll put some links down below for a, a canvas company a, a print company that I use that are on Facebook uh, their name is Click Print Canvas uh, I've used them a few times and uh, I mean, I'm, I'm really pleased with the, the quality and the detail that you get from the images from the canvases and prints so I'll put their link down below you can check them out uh, thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to click on subscribe if you could and also like the video please. Uh, share it with as many people as you can and uh, cheers.